Hi everyone, so this is the end of day 9. Uh, I can say that it, this day was uh, hot, humid and wet. Uh, from, the mo in the mo from the morning it was really, really humid, very, very hot. Uh, so we were sweating like anything and it was getting even worse and worse. Uh, around the noon it was uh, really, really hard. Uh, everybody try, uh, tried to, to do his best or her best. Uh, but then in around, uh, I think, two, 2 in the afternoon, it's starting to uh, rain, suddenly, from <laughs> nobody actually expected it. Uh, it was really, really hard, heavy rain for, for about uh, an hour, but it really helped because it, uh, it really clear, cleared uh, the, uh, the, the weather. It was still hot, but its uh, humidity went uh, rapidly down, and uh, it was then it was much easier to run. And uh, yeah, and uh, at the end, uh, uh, for example, for example, me, uh, this was I think first day after a couple of last days that uh, I could still in the evening, late in late evening or late night, I still uh, could keep uh, some energy to, to run and I did not feel 100% uh, dead. Uh, so uh, for me it was uh, quite quite a good day. I did uh, 117 laps, yeah, which was really good because uh, considering the, the morning uh, weather and humidity, it was really hard. Uh, at Mavir, uh, he had a, another very good day, uh, of course during the the hot weather he was suffering because he's always very sensitive to to the heat yeah but uh, he did it uh, i think also 124 laps or something like that basu yeah i, I haven't seen him from almost all day he was um, yeah just running his pace and um, i don't know exactly how much he did but it looks he, he did really good uh, yuri uh Ashpihanal, uh, I think he had a, much, a better day than yesterday because his yesterday he somehow suffered. He looked like uh, like a little bit sick, but uh, today he felt, looked uh, much better and also he was running much better. And uh, yeah, he is now okay. Yuri, uh, he I asked him during the heat. He said it was really hot for him. Yeah, but anyway, he, he did not. It did not seem that it, he minded that, that heat. Sarvagata in the morning. He, uh, he he told me that he felt like uh, he had some like a shin splint had started on his uh, leg, but uh, in the afternoon you know, the bandage which he had on the foot uh, disappeared, so probably it wasn't that serious and it got better. Surasha, yeah, as usually she's uh, she still is really uh, very strong. I uh, spoke with her in the evening and she said like it was harder during the the heat but then, then in the evening now it was much better Chopin uh, yeah in the morning I also in the afternoon he ran really very good his his own pace which he's doing for days and days but in the evening he, it looks like he really suffered he was 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 pushing uh, until the end and uh, yet yeah, it was very hard for him Nidruvi uh, she also uh, had a, a tough day. She ran until the the, the midnight, and uh, yeah, she she had to push like to to do uh, do to do her mileage. And Lahari, the morning he was running good, but uh, then in the afternoon and in the evening he he, he had to walk because yeah, he didn't, his leg felt like uh, felt like very very uh, very weak. He could not really run. Badev, I asked him about the knee, he said it's okay already, so he was running uh, mostly all day, uh, sometimes slower, sometimes faster. Sarah, yeah, she's, she's really strong and uh, also during the heat, I think, I haven't seen her that often, but uh, also again in the evening she was running like anything, she was actually like flying around the, the cross, she was, she was fastest. Especially during these heat, heat waves, it's always very hard to to balance the uh, the intake of of, of, of liquid and uh, eating because especially eating is really hard for for body to you don't feel like to eat but you know that you have to eat because otherwise in few hours you will just 
not be able to run almost uh, anything because it will just run run out of energy. When you when you are running like some shorter race, it's okay. But when you are running this kind of race, is also like uh, after days and days of running, your capacity to store the ener energy, which you usually have in uh, between the uh, muscle cells in the in the in the in, in the legs is already depleted, so you cannot like count it. You will have it there, so you run, 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 and at one point you just feel that there is nothing there and uh, you cannot go anywhere. Uh, so uh, you have to be always careful. You have to try to do uh, eat as much as possible, but also you have to be take, take careful not to eat too much because then it take your energy, and uh, all the energy goes to stomach to digest, and you just you just sleep sleepy and you cannot really run. Okay, that's it for today. I'll uh, mm, you just saw probably the, the short uh, video I, I made yesterday about uh, like about the sunset. So yeah, maybe you enjoyed.